I don't even know if I should bother telling you my dream last night. I'm still terrified right now. I've been up for an hour, maybe a half hour. I don't even know. But it was... <laughs> that's my description of it. I... It was very realistic, and that's what freaked me out the most. And by realistic, I mean it felt real. So that's what made it so terrifying, I guess. But, um, okay, here I go. Pretty much there, my brother was like, oh, my friend, she's seven years old, and she got stuck in this ice place, and we need to go save her. And we were like, okay. So we go to this ice place. And, I don't know, don't ask me, I have weird dreams. You'd think I do drugs before I, like, go to sleep or something, but I don't. And, um, there's, like, she's frozen in ice, and I'm like, oh my gosh, but I was able to, like, pick a block of ice up, which was her, and put her in the vehicle, which was really warm. So she eventually started to melt, and she looked like she was about, I don't know, five, but apparently she was seven. And she was like thank you oh my gosh blah 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 but she was like she acted like she was three and we were just like okay um your friend's a little immature but whatever and apparently she like her mindset was three years old and she just I don't know she was supposed to be seven so my brother's like something's not right with her and I was like okay whatever not thinking anything of it and then eventually her eyes started to like go a different color and they were already a little bit of a red color, but now they were like a dark blood red. And I was like, okay, well, that's normal, right? And um, I can't really fill in all the blanks because I don't remember some of it, but by the end of it, we were at the psychiatrist type place hoping to fix her because she was really messed up in the head. And she was crawling around because eventually she got to like baby size, I don't know how, and she was like bald. And, um,. She was just crawling around and saying stuff, and I feel bad, like I really like kids, not my own, just kids, and I was trying to take care of it, but my parents are like, stop taking care of it, like, this thing isn't normal, and I was like, mom, dad, you can't be mean to it, like, you gotta love it anyways, right, like, we're taking care of her, and they're just like, no, put it down and I was like no I can't and then it started biting at my face and it like had these crazy teeth and I was like oh so I put it on the ground and eventually it was like attacking Chesterfields and like ripping them apart and I was like oh my gosh we are going to die this thing is gonna kill us so eventually like there was like a point where I hesitated to kick it but I had to and then by the end of it I was kicking it and throwing it at walls and like punching it in the face because it was so terrifying and it wouldn't die it wouldn't die and it killed everyone except for me and my dad. It was a terrible dream and I woke up before it could kill me and my dad. So realistic. Because the cops get so mad about people talking on their phone, I'm really scared to vlog because if they think it's like an iPhone or something and I'm calling someone and it's video talking, they're gonna be like, oh, you were talking on the phone, fine, fine. That's what they would do, obviously. That's how they talk, too. I am going to visit my friend I have not seen in like a hundred years. And by a hundred years, I mean I think maybe there's a video with her in October-ish. And yeah, we, uh, her name's Kayla. And you guys have met her once if you've been watching my vlogs from the start. And uh, yeah, that's how long it's been since I've seen her. Sorry if my camera work is terrible. I have to keep my eyes on the road. Yeah, so that's my day. How's yours going? Just enjoyed a fantastic meal at Denny's. How many times have you guys gone to Denny's? I don't think, I think this is my second time in my life that I've ever gone. Uh, it was good. Uh, overall, uh, let's give Denny's a thumbs up and, um, you know, happy birthday to them. I don't know why I said that, but uh, I think I'm a little delusional because I haven't I had a proper sleep because all I was dreaming about was demons last night. So, me. Next time, I won't dream about demons and I'll be able to be less delusional or I can't even talk. This is not okay. Kayla's really good at playing the flute and she wanted me to Shut show up. you guys. Shut up. Shut up. Wow. Oh, wow, you are gonna get noticed off of YouTube for that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hello. I'm flabbergasted, that's all I have to say. Kayla gave me her camera to um, uh, try and fix getting off the, I don't know, getting the footage off of it. I'm, I'm not making sense right now. I'm still delusional. 
Um, video. <laughs> what? That's not PG. Can um, I get hit by a car? <laughs> Anyways, um, so she's giving it to me to try and fix, and I'm kind of scared because what if I break it? What, what if I break your camera? I don't break it. She's only used it once. You're Cassandra. <laughs> I can't get in your car. Ah! Sorry. Thank you. <laughs> Lady looked at me so. This is the camera, and it's kind of nice, and I might use it when she's not looking, and make a hundred YouTube videos and quickly upload them before she can get mad at me. And, I mean, wait, what? Did I just say that? Where's the mall? Awkward. Yep, and, oh, we almost died! You only did it! Okay, but seriously. Okay, but seriously. <laughs> uh, Good freaking driver! <laughs> Um, yeah, we're gonna die, and this is my last vlog again. This is like my hundredth last vlog. And, uh, yeah, these guys are looking like they're having a good day. Well, the setting that I have my camera on right now, I don't like it. I'm taking it off. Sorry if you liked it, but I think you probably all hated it. Don't know yet, because you don't haven't seen my last video. So, yeah, I'm gonna take that off. And, Shaylin's here! Hi! Oh, hi. hi! I missed you! I missed you, too. Including the vlog, right? Yeah, I like all of you. And and me. And okay. Okay, all of you guys. All of you. All of you. I get it! It's like Dave <laughs> Bates' <is> video! <laughs> Whoa, that was weird. That was awkward. We're stalking Justin Bieber. Guys, he's right there. He's right there. It's Justin Bieber. Justin Bieber. No? Oh, he almost saw us. Oh, good thing. So much taller than him, it's ridiculous. Okay, so we're about to do a reenactment of what happened two minutes ago because it was really embarrassing and kind of funny. Maybe you guys can laugh too. Oh, Sandra, what is that? Um, that's just my future occupation. What's on there? <laughs> is that like, like a design you came up with? Like, are you designing clothes or something? Um, I wanted to be a superhero once and I planned my thing, okay? What does this say? Um, okay, this armor is speci specifically goes on your bicep <laughs> and it's just, um, armor, same as chest armor with knives that pop out with a button. <laughs> And apparently that one's for my forearm. I see the, the button. The button, <laughs> the button that's is drawn <laughs> on there. Good. Good. And what's on the back? Oh, good. I included a cape. Mm. Oh, good. Can't forget the cape. Yeah. Apparently, uh, made out of bulletproofness. Bulletproofness. <laughs> <laughs> made out of bulletproofness. Oh, yeah. right. Um, and it apparently attaches to the collar around my neck that I specified as a spike necklace <laughs> slash choker. Oh, um, can you get the, this bulletproofness at Fabricland? <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> so we got a phone call at like... Mm. You have like something hair right there. Oh, yum. Oh, that's uh, that's my uh, gray hair, actually. No, it's... <laughs> it's balled up. Balled up fluff, I don't know. It's two in the morning and there's a phone call and I'm like, oh my gosh, who is calling? So I jump up, answer the phone, and it's my sister asking if she should come home or not. And I'm like, what? And then she's like, yeah, I'm really tired and I want to come home. And she started crying. So now I have to go pick her up. And my parents don't know about it. So let's do this secretively. Are you ready for this, Shaylin? So ready. So ready. Off in the Batmobile. Batmobile. We thought of a YouTube video. Shh. I guess I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Have a good night's sleep.